breaking news. Kenya authorities react to Nami Kano's arrest, extradition to Nigeria. The Kenya's Director General of Immigration Services, Alessandra Meteshi, dismissed the claims of the country's complicity in the arrest and extradition of Mazi Nnamdi Kanu. Immigration and diplomatic authorities from Kenya started, stated that they were not aware of the arrests and extradition of Mazi Nnamdi Kanu, the leader of the indigenous people of Biafra, Nnamdi Kanu, who was not on their soil and brought to Nigeria. The Kenyan's Director General of Im Immigration Services, Alessandra Matachi, dismissed this claim of the country's complicity in the arrest and extradition of Mazi Namdi Kano. Also, an official in the Kenya Ministry of Interior said that the ministry was not aware of the extradition of Namdi Kanu to Nigeria. A spokesperson, the Kenya government officials in separate in, se in separate interview with Reuters and Kenya's nation newspapers debunked the family's claim. A spokesman to the Kenya's interior ministry said that it was not aware of the matter while the foreign affairs minister in nairobi did not respond to a request from comments ruta said in his report also mutsachi while dismissing the family's claim told kenya nation that it was not possible to tell whether mr namikano has entered kenya territory or not I can't know that, Mr. Mit Mr. Muteshi said, when asked whether the claims made by family were true. Nandi Kanu, who is facing 11 counts of treason, treasonable felony, terrorism, and illegal profession of firearms, among others, jumped bail in 2017 and left the country. It was a rearranged it was rearranged before a federal high court in Abuja on Tuesday and ordered to be remanded in the custody of the DSS while the case was adjourned to July 26th and July 27, 2021. Nandi Kanu Biafra is a region almost entirely populated by the Igbo people and was the site of the bloody civil war between 1967 and 1970. The federal government says that security and intelligence agencies were on the trial of Martin Namdi Kanu for over 20 years before he was rearrested. The Minister of Information and Culture, Lai Muhammad, who disclosed this at a media briefing on Thursday in Abuja, said that Nambi Kanu was living a five-star life across several countries. The minister said that Nambi Kanu's rearrest and repartition was made possible through the collaboration of Nigerian security and intelligence agencies. According to reports, it was said that Malami, which is a culture, the Minister of Information and Culture, Culture of Nigeria, whatever, Alaji Muhammad, disclosed that the Afra region is almost entirely populated by evil people and also cited of bloody civil war and he prays that the war should not 
come again or repeat itself. Thank you, viewers, for listening to this news. Viewers, you can imagine you have heard Lai Muhammad's comments. <laughs> Lai Muhammad. You can imagine. What is Lai Muhammad up to? Is he supporting or against Nambi Khan? That is what we don't understand. We don't know what he's even doing. We don't know if he's supporting or if he is against or, or, or the arrest or if that's against Mazin Nambi Khan. This is unbelievable. You can imagine. Should I say he's supporting or is not happy with Nambi Khan's arrest? That is what we don't know. If he's happy or not happy. Anyways, that is left for him. You have listened to what Kenya authority have just said. They have spoken. They said they are not aware that Nambi Khan was arrested in their country. They you know they said the government they said the government is said the, the government said is not aware that Nam Khan was taken was arrested in his uh, in, in their country. You can imagine. Is that a good is that a, 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 an excuse? Is that an excuse before God's Kenya government now sees that people Nigerians are blaming him for allowing these people to arrest uh, Mazin Namdekano in his country. This is why he's saying all of this. He's trying to defend himself. You can imagine, see, he's unaware of Namdekano's arrest. He's unaware. <laughs> this is funny. Unaware or not aware, Namdekano has been arrested. Let them do something about it by releasing Namdekano. Let them come to Namdekano uh, uh, aid. aid. Let Nabi can be released. That is what we want. The deed has been done. So Kenya's Kenya government or government authority officials, whatever he calls himself, should stop blaming himself. It has happened, it has happened. And that is it. So what we need now is for them to intervene and make sure that Nabi Khan is released from the custody of DSS. So viewers, you have heard it all. I want you to drop your comment below the comment box. Click on the subscription button if you have not done that before. If you have done, if you have, if you have done that, you have subscribed to this channel, or you have clicked on the bell button. I will urge you to please click on the like button and also share this news with your loved ones. Thank you.